Hello everyone, this is Melinda of Paul's Tea Thrill to Bro. And I hope everybody's doing well tonight, feeling all right, feeling our blessings. And tonight um, we have a pool for our brother, Sling Blade. And I have it wrote down right here. His uh, questions, question is, ancient astronauts, Pakal and Jesus being the same being, if they are trying to contact Sling, Sling Blade for a particular reason or enlightenment, his uh, future higher self. So, let's see what the cards have to say. I've already cleansed them and held them to my heart. And so, we just need to shuffle and pull them out. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I need to pull four from the top and two from the bottom. Those were the golden row, and these are the, um, the uh, Akashic records. I was looking for the box, and the box is like this. But it's the Akashic records. He's a good guy, you know. Some of you may not know him, some of you may. But he's a really good guy. Okay. There's a card on the floor. I must have dropped, I'll put it over here when I couldn't shuffle him right or something. I don't know. you off the bottom. And then these are the Angels of Atlantis. I have Nog Champa burning. Oh, I put it back there because I've been breathing incense for a while and it was getting kind of thick.
then we'll use um, the cards I made for clarification. Glasses. Okay, the first act, let's get his story. I'll pull them off the bottom because I laid that one first. The Four of Wands. Four of Wands. Ancient Astronauts. The Four of Wands, um, you see some people down here working, and you see some people back there rejoicing. Let's see what else we get. Put it all together. Faded meeting. Friendship. I believe you're onto something there, brother. Violet fire. Then this says transmutation, detoxification, psychic vision. Constant distractions. I'm dyslexic and it's dark in here. <laughs> so maybe y'all could read that a little bit better. But what I'm I'm getting from this is violet stands for spirit for me. And this is the and, transmutation, you know, I'm transforming, I believe, because this is all about self-transforming, you got friendship and faded meeting, four of wands, rejoicing, happiness, leave your own to something, brother. Almost flipped them over. Two of Cups. Yeah. Two of Cups is all about, for me, connections. A bond. A way of life. contracts and we all come down here to this plane with a contract when we was our higher self our light being I truly believe that when we're up where people call heaven we're source or great spirit or God or Jesus or your higher self. All the beings, all the beings, ancient astronauts was there, you know, when we were created, I believe that we were all created. So we was all there and I believe that we come down when we're ready because this is a school I believe that the earth is just a school for us you know and we're here to learn lessons and I'm very fortunate to hear 
about this question, you know, the particular reason, the contact. with Jesus, enlightenment, whether if you believe in Jesus or not, <clears throat> whether if you believe that he was just a man that came down and told people about stuff, if the Bible is true or not, I believe it's a, a way of life, and it doesn't matter how we really believe. As long as it's a 100% good in life and love, I believe we're here to learn love and to find that enlightenment inside of us and just seek out whatever truth we feel is truth. It's a lesson, it's all, all lessons. The War of the Roses. I believe you may be fighting within yourself any past deeds that you have done was all past. All of them. It's all in the past. I believe that Yeah, you're, you're having your awakening. Here's a surrender card. I believe you're having your awakening, brother. Sometimes we just need to not be at war with ourselves or with anybody else. Because it's all about love and connections. Spirit. Angelic realms. A team, yes, a team effort. Charity, validation, patience. It's trying to have patience with yourself and surrender if you choose. It's all your choice. A team effort. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A team effort. War within yourself. If you surrender, there's the angelic realms. Your higher self. Your animal totems. All the love that's surrounding you. Wolves are the teachers. Horses are strength. Next deck. Sometimes I believe that when we surrender and we just say, you know, you know, when I was younger and all the rest of us that hung out or whatever, probably so many more, we used to say, let's go get fucked up. Let's just go get fucked up, man. You know, and then later on, you know, in my in my early 20s, I realized that's what I did. I was fucking up. And for years, I carried around this eraser that one of the kids, I'm sure probably Ricky or DJ, had it extra from when school was out or something like that. And so they didn't want it. <laughs> so I carried it in my pocket for a long, long time. I still have it. Every now and then I pick it up 
to remind myself that I know that I fuck up. I don't do everything right. We're human. And I hope I learned the lessons so that way I don't have to go through whatever it was that I just went through. <laughs> Let's get some more. Well, almost get the card, I think. Yep. The King of Keys. Look at this time period. Moving in slowly. Moving in slowly. The tree rooted down, being grounded. He's not in any rush. The red to me is life. He's not in any rush with his strength and lessons in life. Security. Security. One finger reaching out for another in a bubble of protection around you. With all that geometric. There's so much. Okay, let's keep going here. The Dharma wheel. Karmic lessons. <laughs> Peer pressure, moral codes, yeah. <laughs> moral codes, peer pressure, hey man. You're whatever if you don't want to do whatever because you want to stay at home and listen to some chilled out music and look at some rocks, man whatever you want to do. <laughs> Comes around, goes around, man. If we do good, good things happen. Let's go on with the story. The Empress. Giving, I'm hearing giving birth to Purity, giving birth to purity. She's got all the wisdom and the knowledge and all the angels all around her. Mm. I'm hearing to rest your mind. That your angels and guides and your higher self, the higher power. Everybody's got it. We just got to surrender and say, all right. And then allow, allow life to flow. The Akashic Library. Just allow life to flow. Because whatever's going to happen is going to happen. Whatever's going to happen is going to happen. Inspirate inspiration look at all that light beaming down on a specific spot look at the shape of those look at this sh shape and it looks like it's got wings when it's like this Flying all the light, all the energy. Flying the shapes. Gosh, records. Consciousness. Hmm. Your higher self. Consciousness. Self awareness. Personal realization. Pre, 
free justice, I think. Self-awareness. <laughs> your higher self, man. You're aware of your higher self. I, I truly believe that you're going through an awakening. And there is a whole slew of people, a whole lot of family that's on these YouTube streets that you haven't even met yet that will help you with that. I gotta do is reach your hand out. And maybe they'll reach theirs out. The Queen of Swords. The butterfly. The transformation. So you had the transformation. And you had the. Uh, the other card that. Means to transform yourself. And this Queen man. She's looking out. She's looking out. You got a strong female. There's a strong female trying to give you a message. It's all right. Let's see. Yes. Yeah, the angels, the ones that's on the other side, beyond the veil. We may, some of us may not be able to see the angels and the guides, the people that was here before, but we could see our friends. And they may be knowledgeable. And they're looking at books and she's talking or whatever with her angel or guide, thinking, getting thought drops or whatever. And that's another butterfly up there. That's a fairy, looks like. Looks like to me, huh? <laughs> there you got all kinds of guides and angels and past loved ones you see them there and past loved ones just helping you out to gain knowledge hmm. <laughs> benediction man come on heck yeah man oh my god Oh my God, I'm just... Temple of Mary. <laughs> Emotional expression. Playful innocence. Exploitation. It doesn't matter, ma'am, for real. It's up to you, though. Not my... My son and my niece within like a day maybe two both sent me this well in the family chat we have some that's more than just the siblings and um my niece she sent me that song and the lyrics but she put it in that chat where there's um now, Ricky's not on that chat. And she put out the lyrics and everything of the song, Jesus Freak. <laughs> and then Ricky, he sent me the, the YouTube video about Jesus Freak, man. <laughs> uh, and uh, we used to sing that song. You know, when not Sarah. I mean, my niece, but my son and all of my sons, we'd be driving down the road, you know, and and pop in a cassette or whatever, or on the radio, 
and it'd be that song and we'd just sing it, man, we'd sing so loud. And who cares, man? You know, some people may know you and some may not. It's what's in here. It doesn't matter what anybody thinks of us. It's only if we care. If, you know, what anybody's saying. Oh, I already did that one. The Temple of Mary. Jesus' wife. Benediction. <laughs> the Hudson. Queen of Swords. The Two of Wands. Changing. Got the world in his hand. Or an orb. Right before I started this video, there was an orb that went by. It was going pretty slow, though, really. I know you take walks in nature because you gather up these stones. <laughs> it's got the world in your hands. Just look out and seek. That's what I'm seeing is purity and just purity. There's growth on these wands. There's growth on them. Growing. Becoming aware. And look at that head top, man. Huh. And this way. I know he would have to be this would be the other direction. Huh. Hmm, you know what that means. Then maybe when people come to check you out and give you some love, maybe a little guidance, some support, maybe they'll see some of your rocks and your loving heart inside you. Okay. The Akashic Field. You got the library and the field. And I always think that I feel like green and blue, these colors are healing in violet or purple spirit. And then there's serenity and life, multiple lives. The field is all around you. you walk in the field. Ecstasy. Man, look at that man. She's just like laying back and surrendering. Look at the angels. They got her. They got her. And look at all the light around. And the little angels at the bottom. Just angels and brilliant bright light. well-being, self-preservation, service to spirit, youthful experience. It doesn't matter how old we are or how young we are when we learn about the awakening within self. It doesn't matter how old or young you are. the feeling inside it may have been I don't want to say that out loud okay that was all the cards oh the karmic trench 
This is one that fell on the floor somehow. The karmic trench. You may be feeling like you're in a rut, but look at the work that he's doing, man. Planted seeds. You may have had seeds all your life. All your life. And he's getting what grew. Our plan. Plan, maybe. Okay, I'm gonna throw some of these cards. I need to use my pendulum too on something. I already did this one. Right there. <laughs> Acceptance, let go, trust, enjoy your beauty. Acceptance. <laughs> if we can accept, if it's bad, something that's something bad that happened, if we could accept it to know that. Everything's for a reason. It makes it a whole lot easier on us. And accepting love and joy and trusting our inner self, our higher self. Your beauty. Mm. Summertime playtime. Jumping in the water, diving off the board, sliding down the slide, or just floating, or just floating. They're having a good old time, having fun. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Maybe you're ripening up. Okay, one more off the top. The magician. The magician has all the tools, all the tools. This guy transforms he could stand on two legs and become a beautiful man or woman. Or he could walk on all fours. He's a magician. Transformation. You have all the tools. Pick the tool that you need for various times. And if you had, you had the karmic wheel too, dharmic wheel. And if you have all the tools within you, and then you carry the toolbox wherever you go, because wherever your feet are is wherever you're at. And it just doesn't matter as long as we take the first step and accept. Okay, off the bottom. Pew. 
your blood. Your descendant. Your descendant from the ancient astronaut time. Your being. It was one of your past lives. It was one of your past lives. Yeah, yeah, and I forgot I had put like flowers and leaves growth. <laughs> that is awesome. Then the other one off the bottom. No, no, the Pacao wasn't Jesus. I'll use the pendulum too. But you, you are a descendant of the ancient astronauts. And I think that they, they were like the lions or something. Enlighten, no way, heck yeah. Enlighten, man. Ha! <laughs> Part of your question, are they trying to contact you for a particular reason? Enlightenment, the future higher self. Your higher self is your higher self. There's your enlightenment. All the light all around it, all the yellow. Ah. <laughs> Heck yeah, man. I gotta get those three that fell too. Doesn't matter how fast or slow you go, you're gonna, you're gonna cross that finish line and it's gonna be alright. I gotta take one, uh, two off the bottom and then get those three. Life can be a puzzle. It can be. Or a race to find the finish line. A race to find the finish line. What? <laughs> Heck yeah, man. This is amazing just amazing acceptance huh. I gotta take one up more up the bottom past experiences Past experiences. Doesn't matter if it's in the past. Doesn't matter if it's still the future. <laughs> you're, you're gonna be finding you a whole bunch of love and joy, man. And a woman. A woman's love. Make, make sure that they're not there to steal your heart. You need your heart. And she's going to need her heart space. Don't give nobody your heart. Allow them to merge. And you had the ecstasy card. Mm -hmm. I got a pull from these ones that fell. See what they are. Oh my.
you are the one that why I drew that. <laughs> More light. More light. And the red light. It's a red light. The red the swirls. The life. Enchantment. I'm here in enchantment. You no freaking way, man. Look at this. You got both. Both of the rainbow cards. Both of them. You swirl all the colors of the rainbow together and it makes black. So it doesn't really matter if someone shuns you. If someone hurts you. Stole your heart. And left. Leaving the whale. The why. I've done everything for you. She got what she wanted. Both of the rainbow cards. Both of them. There's only two. In a hundred. One card stayed. Let's see what it is. A house. And there's some more colors in your house. It's three, the power of three. What did I say I needed to take? No, there's 180 cards, 180. And both rainbow cards came out together. What's the middle card? <laughs> the music drumming to your own beat drumming to your own beat man fuck the rest okay you were the one I think that I made this for I made this like two months ago maybe longer I don't know why I started with the I because I had a thought drop that there was, <laughs> this might sound ridiculous, but this is what it was. I had had a thought drop of a third eye, which we all have, and we could train our minds to understand more about that but the third eye I made this because I thought somebody had an eye booger I thought they had an eye booger <laughs> covering their third eye and look for whatever reason I made it I made the flower last so but the sun, the sunlight, and then the red flower, red is life to me. Blood, life, and the flowers, purity. And in the middle of this flower, I just seen the word yes. I didn't even know I put that in there. Y E S. I just made the flower. I didn't know I put that word in there. Oh my God, there's a little eyeball too. Huh? And A A S. 
ass eye, your third eye. What the heck? Wonder what else is in there. There's another eye. You know how we are, we see things and things. Yeah. Clear out your clear out your eye booger in your third eye. <laughs> I don't know. I love you, brother. And I wanna use the Oh, we already got the question though. They wasn't the same. It was you who had the connection with Pacal. The ancient aliens. And I noticed this when I was doing whatever, because I have hundreds of rocks and stones and crystals around me. Well, that one you can't see. Well, you can't see these either, I guess. But look what I was noticing. <laughs> the eye, the nose, the mouth. Let me rub on it. Maybe it'll sometimes that for whatever reason. See there? And look what else I was noticing. It looks like the ship. Ancient astronauts. There's a face up there. Probably faces all over it. Some big long thing coming. Is that a seed or something? Let's see what else is on there. Like a genie lamp. Hmm. Yeah. Let's look for the people though. Yeah, here he is. There he is. I, I look for an image. I ask Google for the image of Pacal. And it came up with a guy with these things in his ears. The big, um, what are they called? Dig on it. Man, I used to sell all kinds of um, earring things, but they were plugs and all kinds of stuff. I forget what it's called now. Whoa, look at it that way. I don't know if that's picking it up. Maybe it is. I don't even know where the camera is. <laughs> or maybe it was backwards. I don't know if anybody else is still watching this. But do you see how they put these images inside these stones? This one's a piece of chert. There's a horse, a strength. <laughs> oh, the snake. The snakes has something to do also with the Mayan people. I remember watching this video years ago about the two snakes and when the sun hits it, it looks like they're, it's going up and then down. You got the snake card too. Brother, you're on the right path. You are. Check out all those awesome cards, man. 
check it, check all this out. Dang on. do is slightly move it and everything changes. Everything, temples. Look at the pyramids. Huh. And the snake. When it comes down, when the sun goes. Whoa, brother. This one, this stone actually fell. It was right here. I had it here for, I was going to say, I don't know why it was there. It was just there. But you know how you just place stones, places, and it fell on the floor. <laughs> Somehow, I don't remember how. And so, oh man, and so I picked it up and put it up there. Mm-hmm. Man, I could look at this rock forever, but this is um, over 50 minutes, 53 minutes. <laughs> If you're still watching it, I hope so. And it'll probably take an hour to load. <laughs> I love you guys. I love you. Be kind. Be kind to yourself. Love yourself. Be gentle. From my heart to yours, I love you guys.